Plus, a weekly look at local news in Amarillo presented by Town Square Media. From News Talk 940, I'm James G. Leading off news to us, it's guns, guns, guns. That group of heavily armed people walking along Sansi Saturday afternoon was not a call out of the Texas State Militia, but was instead the first open carry walk in Amarillo held by Open Carry Texas, an organization that advocates the passage of laws making it legal to carry a firearm openly in Texas. Because what could possibly go wrong? Everything may be bigger in Texas, but it may surprise you to learn 44 other states allow some form of open carry of firearms, but Texas does not. Amarillo was the last major city in Texas to host an open carry walk. Other things Amarillo doesn't have yet include a jack-in-the-box, a multi-use sports and concert facility, or a decent excuse for allowing Stanley Marsh to go on so long. Load them if you got them. And now from the Hacker Morning Show, let's go to Tommy the Hacker, staff meteorologist, with a look at your weather. Thank you, James G. Currently we're standing at 22 degrees with a high of 43 degrees. Tomorrow we're going to warm up to a nice 54 degrees. But hold on, don't pull out the Daisy Dukes yet because we got snow coming. Yay! Snow! Snow! Coming Thursday and Friday. Now, let's send it back out to Angel D. A potential deadly bacteria that originates from hospitals and is a national epidemic has finally arrived in Amarillo. The bacteria is known as C. diff and can cause inflammation of the large intestine, abdominal pain, and in some cases, death. It is also a very unpolite thing for people who are traveling through I-40 not to give us the courtesy of stopping and filling their tank up with gas or even attempting the 72 ounce steak. Now, out to Dallas Chambers for sports. Thank you so much. Dallas Chambers here and look at your world of sports. There's a lot going on in the world of wrestling. That chick put down that one girl in like 14 seconds. Ronda Rowdy Rousing won the match faster than I can lose ratings. Dang. Okay. WT locally continues in the postseason for a tournament match. That's going to be awesome right there. Also locally, Tommy the Hacker beats Angel D in the quarter mile dash in high heels on ice faster than that chick put that other chick down in wrestling. Um, also, Jose Canseco, he uh, puts his middle finger up for sale, flipping you the bird. Because it fell off. Uh, after falling off, it can be bought on eBay. Slightly used middle finger with over 462 home runs on it. Now, back to Mix 94.1's Lori Crawford for more news. Lady Gaga took the Chicago Polar Plunge on Sunday. She jumped in Lake Michigan riding on the back of her fiancé, Taylor Kinney. Luckily, he wasn't in werewolf form. Leonard Nimoy was laid to rest on Sunday. Nimoy was best known for playing Spock on Star Trek. His co-star, William Shatner, who played Captain Kirk, was unable to attend the funeral due to scheduling conflicts. He is now being labeled Captain Jerk. Well, don't worry. There's a Vulcan death grip waiting on you, Captain Jerk. From everyone at Town Square Media, thanks for watching. And log on to YouTube next week for another episode of this little Fandango. And as always, remember, if it's news to you, it's, it's news to us. us.